In this tip, I want to discuss engineering units. When I build a flow sheet from scratch, as I did this one, ChemCAD loads a default set of engineering units. For example, in my case, this particular stream is 177 degrees Fahrenheit, units of pressure PSI, units of flow pound moles per hour. To find out what the entire global set is, go to Format, Engineering Units, and arrive at this dialog box. My default set is English, and this is in hours, pound moles an hour, degrees Fahrenheit, PSI. There are a variety of sets stored in ChemCAD besides English, Common SI, Formal SI, and metric. If I wanted metric to be my default set of units instead of English, I could click on metric as shown here and save it as the default. Let me go back to English. I can also make changes. For example, instead of pound moles an hour, I can choose pounds an hour. Let's suppose I have a client for which I'll be doing a lot of work and this is the profile or the flow rate that that client is interested in. I want to save it so I don't have to make changes every time I build a flow sheet. I can either save it as a profile to be able to be loaded up whenever I wanted it or I can save it as my default. Whenever I make a change on this dialog box and then click OK, the flow sheet globally changes. So what was pound moles an hour is now pounds an hour. So 200 pound moles an hour becomes 7,800 pounds an hour. When you do a report to arrive at the stream properties, those properties are displayed in the default set of units or the global units that you're currently using. So for example, I'm in temperature degrees Fahrenheit and pressure in PSI. Every stream is now in pounds an hour. So, to make a global change, format engineering units, develop and save a profile, develop and save a default set, or choose one of the built-in default sets for all flow sheets. Sometimes, I want to make a local change. For example, if this stream were coming from a pump, Perhaps what I would prefer is weight fraction and GPM. 200 mole per hour is now 18.7 GPM. When I make a local change, I did not affect the other liquid stream. It's still in pounds an hour. Sometimes, however, I'm interested in just doing a units conversion. For example, if I wanted to know how many Kelvins it's equivalent to 200 degrees Fahrenheit, I can go to Tools, Units Calculator, select Temperature, put in 200 degrees Fahrenheit, press Return, and arrive at 366 Kelvins. This particular units conversion does not affect any of the measurements and units on the flow sheet. But I can do a variety of units conversion as noted in this menu. Not only in terms of physical properties, but also in terms of measurements such as length, area, and time. 
So, in summary, format engineering units to build a profile or to use one of the defaults, to save a default, to load a pre-existing profile, and to globally change the flow sheet. What was GPM is now pounds an hour. I can make local changes to flows and compositions. I can also do unit conversions for a variety of physical properties and types of measurements. ChemCat gives you complete flexibility in developing and using the units of your choice. This tip showed you how to set and convert engineering units. Thank you for using ChemCAD. For more tips, please visit ChemStations.com. My name is Chip Howitt.